This is John Stonehill of CheckTheirFridge.com. I'm here with Dan Adut. Hi, guys. We're going to check out Dan's fridge and see what it'd be like to date the Dan. When it comes to checking someone's fridge, nothing is black and white, but nothing says more about what we are or who we are than what we eat and what we drink. Interesting. And that really is all in our fridge. The main social activity we do during dating is eating and drinking. Yes. So the translation to the fridge is so direct for that. On dates, we eat and we drink. That's what we do. Now, looking at your fridge, I definitely see somebody who's slowly but surely outgrowing a space. Now, you're doing great with your career. You're obviously busy, and now your fridge is pretty full. You're getting to a point where maybe you're in a place in your life where you're soon getting ready to upgrade your space just because you could see the where your lifestyle is taking you, yeah. which is great. You're now filling up your fridge to the brim. I see a lot of great stuff here. You got a uh, watermelon. Now, with a watermelon this big, yeah. what this says to me is you're looking to either host or you're looking to be a good guest. Yeah, I host a lot. Um, I host a lot. Uh, actually, on every Sunday, I have something called football and frittatas. What sticks out to me is that you have multiple beer brands. Mm -hmm. And what that says to me is a great host. Uh, Yellow Pills, which is a good beer. Corona. You got this, the Dale's Pale Ale. The Dale's Pale Ale, oh. Accumulation. I don't even know that brand. Yeah, it's in New Belgium. They do, okay. they do uh, fat tire. Well, what, what this says is you're catering to multiple tastes. A lot of this stuff is truly very relevant to dating. Now, first off, one thing that we all care about is appearance. You have enough stuff in your fridge that says to me you take care of yourself. You're eating very healthy. You have fruits, you have a lot of vegetables. You're obviously fueling those workouts. I could say from the fridge alone, your fridge tells me that you're a guy that's taking care of himself. You're a guy that's staying in shape. And that's I, important. And I think that um, something to note is that I don't have anything in my fridge that's low fat or non-fat. And I mean, I have very rich foods. I try to eat like um, good, good whole foods, but just yeah. like I don't eat like a maniac. Something else which I could see from your fridge is you're very well read and very well cultured. You know about foods that most people don't know about and most people have never heard of. Mm -hmm. You're well traveled. That's a big turn on for a lot of women. They want somebody who's worldly. And also you're a foodie. People love food. The fact is that you know about all these foods, you know how to prepare them, you know how to cook. Right. It's a great quality. So, I mean, looking here, you have kimchi. Yeah. That's a product. It shows that you're definitely making yeah. meals at home. A lot of guys won't do that. It's not like you're just reheating a meal. You're actually putting a meal together. This is dried squid, These fermented pickles. I always wanted to buy salt cod so that I can make like bacalao. Foie gras from France is illegal in California now. Wow. Like, this is some special occasion food. The guy is ready to celebrate. Yeah. So, let's see what we have in the freezer. Okay. So, yeah. Stock. This is stock that, uh, homemade stock makes a meal infinitely better than, than supermarket stock. Plenty of ice cubes, so when your boys are over, you have ice to make drinks. Yeah. These are great for cocktails, like for scotch on the rocks, just put one big rock in there. And last but not least, I like the fact that you have a little dessert. Again, if it's late night, she's hungry, you have the munchies. Yeah. All you need is a couple of spoons, you have dessert, you're prepared. Where I like what go? I see, man. Yeah. I mean, some people's fridge is just a storage device. This this guy's fridge, we, we got a tool chest here. This guy, is, is it, he's got his tools to make an amazing meal and to impress one lucky lady. Deadly. Or a few right lucky here. ladies. Or I a few mean, lucky I'm ladies. I'm not above having a foodie threesome. We can do that. You heard it all right here and check their fridge. Yeah. Check it out. So there you have it, folks. That was Dan Adut's fridge. Thanks for having me. Uh, I hope... Uh, Ladies, you got a little insight as to uh, what I do with my way too much free time, apparently. I think we got to know Dan uh, much better by checking out his fridge. I think he has a lot to offer his dates. So ladies, I highly recommend Dan is one eligible bachelor you should go out with. Thanks, and we'll see you next time on CheckTheirFridge.com. Bye. Bye now.